<laughs> Scorpio, you're like, I'm just having a great time. I'm just enjoying myself. I'm just loving this taboo bitch. I'm loving these energies. I'm loving this witchiness. I'm loving this, this, ooh, this, this good, good, good. I'm loving this good, good. I'm loving it. 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 Yes, allow yourself to love it. There's a lot to love. Intro. Oh, happy full moon in the Capricorn. Happy full moon in the Capricorn. Happy full moon in the Capricorn. Come on, Capricorn. What we're doing is we're talking about authenticity. We're talking about authority. We're talking about facilitation. We are talking about the authoritative, the facilitative side of what was started in January. When we booped into January, remember when the sun was in Capricorn and the full moon was in Cancer? Well, this is when we get to actually facilitate what was started then. What has been the theme all year? Hashtag 2021. If you've been following me, it has been the Ace of Pentacles. This is when we actually get to facilitate what was planted if we planted something then. Boom, this is what's happening for this full moon cycle. Now here's, here's what you need to understand first about hashtag cancer season. When the sun goes into cancer, the sun says, I'm going on a vacation, bye. <laughs> the sun says, goodbye, moon, you take over. This is your time. Meaning for the duration of cancer season, we focus on our feelings and our moods. If you do not express your feelings and your moods this season, you are going to explode. It is going to be a pressure cooker, a pandemonious trauma. Okay. Um, cancer is the very first of the water signs, meaning Pisces, the depth of the deep sea. By the time that the water gets to the shore, we have like little minuscules of memory of what's down there, of what's washed up to shore. So all season of cancer, all cancer season, as the moon cycles through each sign every two and a half days, it hits a different sign. It started, the cancer season started with the moon in Scorpio. Hello, taboo. Hello, investigative magic. The moon cycles through from Scorpio, hits Scorpio again to Sagittarius and Capricorn again. We end cancer season with the moon at Capricorn again. This is the full, what is happening in this full moon is the full harmony, the full choir, the full expression, the full energy of what you will be able to execute at the end of the month, the end of the cancer season. July 20th. You feel it on the 24th of June, and then you get to actually tap into it and have another check-in again, right before we boop into Leo season, right before we play. Ooh, 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 another thing to think about. I love that Pride is during June, and I love that Cancer season is hashtag June. It's a chance for us to say, hey, I'm prideful of my feelings. I'm prideful of my moons. I'm prideful of my soul's journey. I'm prideful of my connection to femininity. I'm prideful of my connection to the moon. I'm prideful of my cycles. I'm prideful of my patterning. I'm prideful of how I'm listening and expressing my moods and my feelings. Ah. Uh. <laughs> if you would like a an in-depth a uh, forecast of, of the cycle of the moon for this cancer season, go to my Patreon because I, I broke down every two and a half days uh, the order of the moon and what planets are around the moon as it cycles. Um, very, 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 very helpful if you are a lunation type of human. What we're doing for this full moon exploration, simple. We are checking in with authenticity. What is the moon's message for each sign's authenticity? Capricorn is groundness, it's a rock, it's foundation setting, it's, it's boss bitch, it's boss bitch, it's authority, it's whose mountain are you actually climbing? 
Let's check in with how we can say yes to authenticity this lunation cycle, this full moon energy. Boom, boom. Okay, Scorpio, here is your chicken nugget. You've been in really, you, you're, you're, um, you're really involved this lunation cycle. You're really involved this cancer season. You're really involved this full moon. You're like, you're doing a lot. You're doing a lot. You're doing a lot. Um, understand that the container of which you are communicating must be cleansed this full moon. Because of your work throughout the cancer season, this full moon wants to burn away all of the shit that you do not need in your container of communication. Allow this, the radiance of this full moon to burn away your attachments of rock bottom that are lingering in the container of which you communicate, your attachments to brokenheartedness that are lingering in the container of which you are communicating. What wants to be in the container of communication is no longer this and this. This is, this is radiant, this is emotional radiance. This is autonomy, this is expression, this is expressing emotions, this is everything that you are advocating for in others. This is everything that you are trying to get other people to do. This season, not only cancer season, but this full moon is a chance for you to purge yourself of the attachments that you have picked up from other people. You're very busy this season. You're very busy, 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 busy. Ask yourself, am I busy doing this work? Am I busy cleansing out my, my container of communication? Am I busy purging myself of the negative attachments that I don't need anymore, rock bottom brokenheartedness? Am I busy doing that? Or am I busy trying to control other people? If you allow the moon to take you on a journey towards emotional radiance, then text me about it because I'm really excited to see what happens. Okay. Yes, we did do that. Yes, we did. Thank you for watching. If you know your moon sign, go watch your moon video. If you know your rising, go watch that. Like I said, everything is reacting to the moon right now. So when in doubt, speak to the moon. When in doubt, converse to the moon. If you want more information about cancer season, you have a, a more in-depth video on the Patreon. You also have meditations on the Patreon. You also have the, the cancer workshop that I just did that's available on my website. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful exploration. I am going to be road tripping with my mom during cancer season, yes. And I will still be taking readings and stuff while I'm on the road. You're not alone, I'm here for you. If things get overwhelming, let me know. And happy pride, happy pride. Happy Pride, 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 Pride. <laughs> Hello, paulfunnigan.com. Says what Paul is my fellow. Goodbye. <laughs>